Hi everyone, so today I'm going to be showing you what I have in my school bag. So this is kind of like a what's in my school bag video. My school bag I love. Um, I actually saw this bag on Pretty Little Liars. Um, Spencer had it in I think the beginning of season 2 she had it. And I just remember like she was running out of the house and then she had it on her kitchen table. And she like picked it up and then she started like walking out the door. And I was like, oh my god, I have that same bag. And I was like freaking out. And I like yelled at my mom, mom, she has my bag. Because I just really love the um, Pretty Little Liars kind of like fashion. I think they all have really cute, um, really cute clothes. So I was like so excited when I saw it that one of them actually had like something that I have. So this is what my purse looks like, well, or my school bag. And right now it's super heavy because at my school we actually have like even and odd days. So I actually have both even and odd day um, things in here. So I guess I'll just go through everything and show you what I have in my bag. So the first thing I have is my binder, which I actually, um, I really like decorating my binders and like putting in new, um, I guess, slips and pictures. So this is what mine looks like. Um, I actually got inspired by like Teen Vogue and just fashion magazines. So I have, um, what's his name, Paul Wesley. Is that his real name? Yeah, Paul Wesley right here. And then I have like Chanel, Vans, um, a skateboard. And I think it says, anything you can do, I can do sweeter. And then it has like Taylor Lawton or National Green, a passport because I love traveling. And then just like a fun picture and another Teen Vogue. And um, Dolce & Gabbana, love, fashion, a supermodel. Um, and then what's her name? Taylor Mosley from uh, from Gossip Girl. Um, I actually am not really a huge fan of her. I just thought she fit there really nicely. And then on the back, I have like a bunch of guys from Teen Vogue and Seventeen Magazine. So I just pretty much put every guy that I thought was cute here. And then I also have a picture that my friend made for me. And she says that this is me as a mermaid. <laughs> Most of these guys, I don't really have like celebrity crushes on anymore just because some of these guys I kind of like outgrew. I actually made this um I actually made this probably about two years ago so that's why I still have like Justin Bieber and stuff on here. Now I'm kind of like most of these guys I'm kind of just like over and I don't think are that cute anymore. That's because my taste hasn't really changed but there's like new celebrities and stuff. So the next thing I have is just a notebook that I use for physics so it has like a bunch of really boring like physics stuff and yeah <laughs> and then I have Pride and Prejudice which is a book that we're reading in English class right now and it was so funny because the movie was just on TV yesterday so I watched it um, and I actually really liked the movie I saw the movie before we actually had to read this in class and I always really, really liked it but I never really understood what was happening in the movie. And now that I'm reading the book, I kind of feel like I know what's happening. I know who the characters are. And the book is really good. And then I just have like this pencil case. And then I have my clicker, which we have for school. And then my calculator. And I also have a graphing calculator. <coughs> calculator, which is not in here right now. The next thing I have is this notebook for pre-calculus. And it just has a kitty on it. Um, my aunt from Russia actually gave this to me. And it just has a lot of boring, like, pre-calculus stuff. Um, which is so, so confusing. Um, and then I have my planner, which I just put my homework in. And I'm sure you probably have one too. And then I have my pencil case, which is actually in a makeup bag. And I just have, like... They're not really interesting pencils or anything. I just have like highlighters and pens and lead pencils and yeah, stuff like that. Um, and then right here, I guess I should stand up. Oh, and then right here in my purse, I actually just have like, um, can you see that? I have gum and then I have a wrapper and then I have, I guess I can show you guys this. Um, I have hand sanitizer from Bath and Body Works and, oh, from Bath and Body Works, and this is in Caribbean Escape. 
and it smells really good. It's actually really strong. So every time I use it, like everybody's like, did somebody spray perfume? And then, yeah. Um, then I have a little Conair mirror, which I got in some set that I got for my birthday like a long time ago. Then I have a chapstick. Um, I have a strain that we actually had to tie uh, some pl somewhere on our body um, for like a test on like, um, what was it? Like, I think it was like drug addiction. We had to do a test and we, have, we had to have that strain on. And then I have a paper with my homework on it. In the front, it actually has a pocket. And let me just unzip the pocket. Um, I just have like a whole bunch of random things in the house. Oh my gosh, did that say my school? Well, I have the keys to my house. Um, I have some cookies. Um, these are 100 calorie bites, which have been in my backpack for like weeks. Um, then I have my ID, and I'm not really sure how I'm going to show this to you. Okay, then right here I have my ID, which I guess is an okay picture. I looked kind of red because it was like so hot in our... Um, cafeteria when they were taking the pictures and then I have like papers for um, code blue which we have at our school and that's like if you didn't do your homework you have to you can only use one code blue per quarter um, and then you just have to you get a few extra days to do it and turn it in and then I also have a, um, I also have an almond and apricot um, fruit and nut bar which I love I love these so much but um, I ate so many of them that now I feel like I'm kind of like sick of them. So that's been in my backpack for a while. And then I have a comb. Kind of boring. I have more random papers like bathroom slips. And I have a candy cane from Christmas time. Uh, I have a coffee stamp thing, which only has one stamp. Uh, my flash drive. Some random hair ties, hair clips, a sucker, which I got from my English teacher, um, some bobby pins. So you can easily tell this is a very girly backpack. So I guess now I'll show you like the overview of my bag better. So this is what the front looks like. Oh my gosh, that glare is like bothering me so much. Okay, so this is what the front looks like and the straps are kind of like a... Um, I guess kind of like a light brown leather color and uh, then uh, it has like buckles right here and then here's the front and then it looks like this and here's the back and I actually love this bag so much it's so cute and it goes with like any outfit and the brand it's by is Converse One Star and I got this at Target in case I didn't tell you already um, is there anything else I need to say oh yeah so it actually has a button that you button and I actually I guess I pulled this too much so now you can kind of see where it's like a tear so now I actually have to pull it from the bottom so I don't rip it so I think this bag will last me probably the rest of the year I'm not sure if I'm going to use it when I'm in college because it'll probably get wear out and be ripped by then but for now it's a really nice bag and I think it's super cute and I really like it so um yeah, that has been everything that's in my school bag. I hope you guys enjoy the video, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.